Yesterday was a very active day across the upper Midwest. We had large hail, damaging winds, and even some tornadoes. At least that's what we're thinking. National Weather Service will be out conducting surveys today across parts of southeastern Minnesota. Much cooler temperatures will be on the way. We're expecting some chilly conditions through the end of September now. This was a view from Fairmont, Minnesota. I want to thank Fairmont Weather Obs uh, for this picture. They relayed this to the National Weather Service out of the Twin Cities, but the tree down there is that line of thunderstorms moved through. Again, mainly wind damage and some uh, tornado damage. Again, those red dots here just south of Minneapolis where those tornadoes were reported. So that's where the uh, st uh, storm surveys will be uh, conducted here today. But even down into parts of uh, Nebraska and Kansas, so a pretty long line of thunderstorms that developed there. Look at how much rain fell. The wettest day of 2018 in Minneapolis, three and two uh, eighths of an inch there. Uh, 3.09 in Sioux Falls, 2.13 in uh, Milwaukee. So record rainfall reports in many of these areas. And we had a record high yesterday in Chicago at 93. But temperatures to the northwest of that front were a good 5 to 15, 20 degrees below average. This is what it'll feel like out there today with 90 still showing up out of the Ohio Valley. And it will be a windy day. Some 30 to near 40 mile per hour wind gusts on the back side of the storm as it moves east. But there is a line of thunderstorms that could be strong and severe today with some locally heavy rain down that way. Again, an enhanced risk of severe weather today over the eastern Great Lakes, but much quieter back to the west and definitely much cooler.